hello guys welcome once again in this video i will show you how to install cmake on your ubuntu operating system i will also show you how to um, make use of cmake and how to uh, build your first c++ program with cmake and qt creator ide so first of all let's see why cmake is important so when you go on uh, the cmake.org uh, the on the first page it's written that cmake is uh, the cross platform open source build system so cross platform is important for us because the program which you build from cmake can be uh, used on different operating system like windows or ubuntu or uh, mac or you can uh, say and you can see the list of uh, distribution on which your uh, program can be used so that's the important thing so whatever program for example c++ program you have built on linux that can be used or reused on uh, your windows operating system it will generate the visual c++ uh, pr project the same project in visual c++ in windows so that's very interesting for us so first of all let's see how we can uh, install cmake on our ubuntu operating system so just open this terminal on uh, your ubuntu operating system and on the terminal you uh, need to paste or you need to write this command so write sudo apt minus get install cmake it's very simple and give your password and it will install in your system and i will say yes So uh, now my CMake is installed in my system. So once this CMake is installed in your system, you you will be able to see in your file system. So if you go to your file system and go to user bin in Ubuntu, you will be able to see this CMake executable. Okay. And now I will launch Qt Creator. So if you don't know how to install Qt Creator on Ubuntu, I also have the t tutorial on that. So just you can search my channel and you can just install Qt Creator. So I will open this Qt Creator first. So my Qt Creator is open now and I'm I will make a new project and build it with cmake so i will go to file new project and go to non qt project here non qt project and you can see automatically here there is an option plain c++ cmake build and plain c project cmake build so i'm going to make a plain c++ cmake build because i'm going to use cmake so i will select this and i will choose and i will give the project name cmake test and you can choose the default location for the project or you can just 
make a new workspace so i will make a new workspace for me qt workspace here and i will choose this workspace here for example and i will say next and i will say finish and now by default when you are making uh, your project using cmake it makes a folder called your project name dash build folder in which all your uh, build or executable file will be there so your source code is in your project folder and in your build folder there will be executable files okay so click next you don't need to do anything it will generate the build folder automatically so click next and here is the important step so whenever you are making uh, this project for the first time you need to give the argument like this so like write minus dc make underscore build underscore type is equal to debug or release whatever you want okay and when you click this run cmake it will compile your project and if you don't see any red uh, red fonts here that means your cmake is working or is ready to work or otherwise in some cases you need to give the path of your cmake directory which i have shown you in the user bin folder right so go to the file system user and bin and here you will be able to find the cmake if it asks for the path for cmake then you need to give the path for the cmake so it's very simple so our project is successfully made and we will say finish so when your first cmake program is built you will be able to see this cmake list dot text which will be automatically generated and when you see here there are some arguments and some uh, cmake code here which is generated by default so this i will maybe explain in next videos this is a hello world program so it is generated automatically i will just right click and say build and it will build my program without any error so this build is done by the cmake build that's important it's not using any other qt make q make build options it's using the cmake option and when i run the program it's running so in this way you can configure and install cmake and write your first program first c++ program in your qt creator with cmake so i hope you have learned something new this time please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now